Hi, and welcome to my paddleboard, inflatable paddleboard review. Today we are going to be reviewing, what is this, the Giel 10-6 paddleboard. <laughs> so I've paddleboarded once already with this and it's pretty nice. Honestly, it's pretty, it's pretty easy to do as I struggle to put it together. Let's talk about the board. So it's 10-6, it looks like this. It's pretty nice, it has a handle there. Uh, what is this thing called? Elastic and a handle at the top if you wanna drag. It also comes with extra like latches if you wanna put more strings or tie stuff to the board. As I said in the failed intro, cause I'm getting eaten alive by mosquitoes, I mean, greenheads, it is inflatable in the package it comes with a leash an inflatable thing extra parts a repair kit like a pump this skeg um and actually it has the one big skeg and then the little skegs an adjustable paddle which floats which is a big deal and the pump and the hose so the pump is actually pretty cool. It has an inflatable side and a deflate side. And on the actual pump itself, it has a like, has like a, a yellow zone, red zone, and a green zone. You wanna be on the green zone. I mean, it's pretty simplistic. Screw your thing. Mine's filled with water. Attach the hose and pump till your PSI. Ooh, PSI is in the green. Here, inflate when you're at your, your hose in the green. Yeah. Let me just unscrew the hose. Ooh. I am five one. I could carry this thing no problem. I'm just gonna plop it down on this beach here. And then I'll talk to you more in the water. Also, this whole video is not going to be like a review. It's going to be like a review and an adventure on the paddleboard. Mainly because <laughs> I do want to paddle around with this thing and have like an adventure. But I know there's people out there that are like, I want a paddleboard, but I'm scared to. What do I buy? So this is just like my basic review of a inflatable stand up paddleboard. Um, I also want to say that inflate took me, I just looked at the recording, it took me under 10 minutes. I think it probably took me about, what, three or four minutes, which is super fast. But again, mine was partially inflated. Like I don't deflate the whole board. I deflated enough to like fold it in my car for transport. very warm. I just have the wetsuit on for sun protection. And we're off. There's only... <laughs> this can only go wet. I really want to dunk in because I'm basically sitting in a sauna. Leash. Okay, so to continue the review part of this, so for people who actually clicked on this video for a review, everything's great. Moves great, turns great. Um, here, I'll stand on it real quick for you. So, yeah. If you want the board like more stiff, just inflate it more. And yeah, overall, give it like a solid. 8, 10. 8 out of 10. Yeah. That's my rating for it. Let's be honest, this is just like a vlog. <laughs> a for effort on your review of an inflatable. This is crazy. I can't believe I'm doing this. Um, oh, that current is strong. It's really... Okay. 
doable. I need to dunk my body in. Extravagant. Actually, it's not too bad going this way. Dunk my body in. No good. Whew. Water feels really nice. So here's the plan. Here's the plan. I sit here and cool off for a second. There's a beach right around the bend of this little cove. My goal is to paddle there and paddle back. There's absolutely no boat traffic, which is cool. There are a lot of greenhead flies, which is not cool. Not ideal. Current, pretty strong. But I think we can do it. One, two, three, oh, no, 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 no. Let's do this. Should I try and stand up? Maybe I should take an insta pick first. I probably could play to this a little bit more. That's kind of it. <laughs> nice little beach. We can go up there and explore. It looks like there's a little sandbar thing over there. I don't really want this on my foot. Oh my god, I should have brought my goggles. Oh, it's really shallow here. Wow, look at all this stuff. Oh my god, this is... This is all pottery. Whoa! Oh my god, wait, I'm gonna paddle back and go get my goggles. That's... So interesting. Paddle back is definitely going to be a lot harder, so hopefully I can get back. But let's take a... My mom grew up here and she um, said when she was little this used to be the dump. So I mean, it's the one I just picked up. We always find like interesting things here. Alright, let's get on paddling back. Yeah, this wake's a little rough right here. Um, excuse me, ma'am. Ah. Another episode of Alex Adventures. <laughs> I'm hungry. All right, let's get to food. Okay, I've uploaded my, uploaded, I've updated my pack here flip-flops I put my phone in a waterproof pouch with my car keys just in case I have to walk back to my car because I couldn't fight the current back wasn't too bad the current coming back wasn't bad after I got around this little thing right here it was definitely intense um, but I could do it water goggles so yeah we're just gonna is this Coast Guard no we're just going to paddle on back to our spot here. And, um, and see if we can find any cool treasure. This is totally not my plan, but this is what's happening. And of course my fins. And water. Did I say water already? I don't remember. So I'll see you there. Alright, I just got back to the beach and hopefully you could see this in the GoPro, but like... You see how the water is clear here, kind of? What is this? Wow, look at this. I might not even have to dive. Look at this water. What is this place? Wow. Wait a second. Wait a second. Pause. Do you see all this glass? Wow, look at that. You see that swirl in there? That's cool. This is all metal and glass. Piece of a teacup. This is 
is so wild. I'm so shocked by like the clarity and what's down here. Hold on, let me paddle for a second. Look at this. Look at all these. It's beautiful, my goodness. Maybe I'll keep that. I don't want to keep everything I find, you know? I don't need it. Save it for other people. I'll stick my goggles on and see what I find. It's it pretty clear. <gasps> Look at all the fishies. goggles and fins on. I hope this is showing up in the GoPro. It's so wild. Look, blue glass. Blue and green. I mean, brown. Melted together. Wow, look at that. That's cool. Put the good stuff here. Look at all this blue glass. Blue. Blue. Oh, I'm getting bit. That boat wake just came through and churned everything up. My shoe's floating in the water. Just wait a minute. I don't get in trouble. Let me go out a little bit more. <laughs> Is that a car coming? Let me check. I have a huge... What is that? That's trash. I hate sticking my face in murky water.
somebody else okay yeah i'm starting to lose the light so i'm gonna paddle back and we'll go over what i found there hopefully i don't lose any of it very dirty i'm gonna throw it in my car I don't think I did a very good job of that, and I'm getting bit by green heads. Okay, time to go. Okay, let's go over what I found today when this board review turned into an adventure. All right, I have no idea what this is, but it's a cool color green, so I kept it. This is just a bottom of a bottle, and it just says something. A A O C O S A A. No idea what that means. This is probably my favorite. Look at this color of this glass. And then can you see that? I don't know if you can see it in there. This like a swirl of white. Sorry, my neighbors are yelling. Next we have this little teacup. Cute, dainty. It has some gold detailing on the top there. I don't know if you can see it. And it has like some flower green what are they called leaves I like that one this green pottery don't know why I kept that <laughs> but it's cool it's pretty and then last but not least we have this really cool foggy um, white glass like I don't know this is cool I like this a lot blue blue glass pretty rare little piece of navy tile and there should be one more where did I lose that oh I lost one. Oh well and um one more piece of blue glass all right guys that's kind of all I got for you today this is everything we found um yeah I hope you enjoyed that video that was kind of fun imprompt random adventure video as always, thank you so much for supporting my channel and watching my videos. It truly does mean a lot and I appreciate it. Keep chasing your dreams and go after whatever you want to do. And again, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next adventure. Bye. See ya.